<laughs> Holy shit, he's back. Um, hello, I'm Mac Titty. I'm finishing up the Bioshock guide on hard uh, in accordance with nextgenwalkthroughs.com. Um, we're going to start this video off. You get a quick glimpse of Fontaine there. Um, we'll be seeing a little bit more of him uh, very, very shortly. But um, this is the last level of the game. Um, you, it's pretty simple. I mean, for what we've done, we, we've built up our wrench. We have uh, all the guns are pretty much powered up at this point. There's a few more stations we hit. No, I think there's two. And uh, your health is almost maxed. I mean, everything's good. You got your plasmids. Um, this would just be a real um, fun time, just putting it all together, finishing up this level. Um, becoming a, a big daddy, uh, that's the quest we have, we have a collection quest in this level that puts us in the suit of a big daddy, and we'll uh, get to have our own little sister for a little bit. So this guide is, um, or this level, uh, starts off pretty easily, um, you get Fontaine who uh, runs away, shoots out the door, and uh, we're stuck um, having to get a little sister to open it for us, and the only way to do that is to be a big daddy. So we start the quest, we uh, pick off this suit control system from the little, or the big daddy that's just lying there. And from there we're going to first collect the boots. They're the closest, um, I guess, component uh, that we can collect. So we'll just go there first. And the rest of the vid is just going to be me going to the library and, uh, you know, getting the boots. So. I'll chime in if anything uh, important comes up, but other than that, uh, keep watching, and I'll see you next vid. That is step one of turning you into one of those disgusting big daddies. The only way to get through that door Fontaine went through is to have a little one open it for you. And they will only trust you if you look like, sound like, and even smell like one of those big, stinking brutes. Besides that camera which you want to destroy, there's a rocket turret right around that corner, so you have to sneak up on it and get it electrocuted as fast as possible so it doesn't blow your ass off. Because even though you're stronger, um, those rockets still hurt. So just watch out for it, and once that's dead, uh, there might be a, a splicer playing dead around here. But other than that, uh, there's a tonic that you pick up and get the boots. So you'll be making a clunky noise for the rest of the uh, level. So I hope you like that. Um, the tonic, I think, uh, I can't remember exactly what it is. It might be an engineering tonic, but it, I don't think it's very important. Um, so again, you don't have to follow the tonics I've been using throughout the guide. Uh, they're my recommendations. Uh, I like to um, stack some more of the powerful and defensive tonics. Um, just because we use electric, uh, the electric shock and the wrench a lot, um, most of my tonics revolve around um, increasing uh, the damages to those weapons. So, um, again, if you just uh, want to do your own thing, uh, just use this guide as just that a guide. Um, feel free to do that. You don't have to do this um, tonic for tonic, uh, step for step. So, uh, take the guide however you want to, and uh, I hope you've had some fun. Damage research, okay, that's what it was. This is kind of a nice one. Um, but I don't think I use it because I have my armor and my wrench jockey and my electric flesh already in there. But um, that just increases your damage to anything you've um, researched throughout the game. Oh, I also want to comment real quickly. Um, it was brought up in some comments or uh, in, a me in a message to me, but um, you take pictures, the little sisters, if you take pictures of them, they increase your, um, little increases to your health and eve. So um, I haven't been doing this guy. I kind of forgot, you know, I play this game so many times that... Uh, I just kind of forget to do things sometimes, but um, if you haven't been taking pictures of the little sisters, uh, now is a good time to start. Uh, they're all over the place, so get some pictures, and uh, I'll see you next vid.